Outreach Center is the place to go for local resources and services. Reporter Egidio Delu tells us everything that the center has to offer. Hello El Segundo and welcome. I'm Egidio Deliu and I'm standing here outside the El Segundo Outreach Office where the El Segundo Outreach Program does some pretty cool things for the community. Let's check it out. Today, we are going to take a ride along with one of the Meals on Wheels volunteers as she is going to show us how the program brings food and a smile to the seniors. This is our program for today and the people I'm going to be delivering to. We shall start the car and be on our way. Maybe we're the only person they see all day long. And we kind of keep in mind too, uh, part of the training, if you see something amiss, like if you come to the door and they got a black eye or they're bleeding or something, you know, um, of course call 911, let their office know what's going on. But luckily I've never had that problem. So you can see the meals are in here. It's the hot pack. The labels are on as to who's gets what when they're special orders. Uh, this particular lady was a ambient Friday fish day. A regular meal and a regular juice. So everyone seems to be getting a hot meal. Uh, they all get a hot and a juice. Mm -hmm. Very nice. And a cold pack. And the cold pack, this particular one, I don't know why we got such a green banana, but it's a green <laughs> banana. The juice, fruit, a little sweet cookie, something. Meals on Wheels! You can see how she was real timid. Yeah. <laughs> She's usually that way. After a successful day of delivering all the meals, Diane signs off for the week. But before leaving, she checks in with Michelle Avensky, the outreach office rec leader, who I got a chance to sit down and talk to. Michelle, what is the El Segundo Outreach Program? Well, we are mainly a resource uh, information center. People come to us uh, looking for different topics such as uh, legal aid, uh, Medicare, home delivered meals, uh, in home services such as uh, elderly care, uh, whether it be clients, um, uh, children of clients, or, or clients themselves that just need extra help in the house. While the Outreach Center aids the entire community, their primary program makes sure our local seniors are well taken care of. Tell us about the El Segundo Meals on Wheels program and what really goes into preparation to get this program ready. It's based on people who are homebound or can't cook for themselves or um, children come in uh, for their parents who live here and they're not local so they want to make sure that mom or dad have a, at least one really good meal um, during the day. And it gives, us, gives it a way for people to have someone check on them at least once a day or, and five times a week. Now if the seniors out there are watching this and maybe want to be a part of the Meals on Wheels or any other program you guys provide here, how do they do, go about doing that? It's very easy, especially for our home delivered meals. Um, all you have to do is either call our office here at the outreach office or the Joslyn Center and they can refer any person, whether it be a, an elderly person or, or a child, um, to our office. And usually we can get them started within 48 hours. Now, what is the most rewarding part of your job? Seeing those seniors that really enjoy having someone stop by and talk to them for a little while. It means a lot to those seniors. It, sometimes they're the 
only person that that senior might see in that day. And just knowing that you make, your, make their day by stopping by and saying hello, that's the most rewarding. On the other end of that, what is the most difficult part about doing this job? Probably dealing with loss. When you work with seniors, you lose people you become friends with. This is someone you might talk to day in and day out, and one day they're not there anymore. The outreach office at this time has about 24 volunteers, with 10 being scheduled on an everyday basis. What a great day of events. We talked to Michelle and learned a whole lot about the outreach center. Took a ride with Diane during her Meals on Wheels volunteer day. That was definitely a humbling experience for me. Well, that's gonna do it for El Segundo TV. I'm Aguirre Deliu.